Okay, my name is Rangachari. I am a professor emeritus in the Department of Medicine at McMaster, and I have been at McMaster since 1981, so it's a long time. Uh, that's a loaded sentence because, again, it requires you to define what you mean by learning and what you mean by knowing. So, considering that there is infinite amount that we need to know, there's always more to know, and the more we learn, obviously, we're going to find more gaps in our knowledge. Therefore, the answer to the question is yes. The more we learn, certainly, we know that we don't know enough. Otherwise, you know, we'll cut the ground from off our feet as far as research goes, and that means that the university as a, as a haven of scholarship will cease to exist. Well, it's just a lot of amusement, actually. I mean, I fundamentally, uh, I can't even believe that, that I'm earning a living, actually having a, a wonderful time, really. So I get up in the morning and say, thank God I'm alive. It's a lot of fun, really. And so there is no... I think that's what really makes a university so vibrant. It's a sacred space where one can essentially be as, as liberated as one wants. Ah, that's a difficult question because, well, I mean, just the notion that the university is a very privileged space that we are really very fortunate to be living in a very safe country where about the only things that we have to dodge are some stupid words from people and not bullets and that we can actually go home and say that we know what the next day is going to bring without fear of reprisals or whatever. So the more open the university is, the better it is. And I think we're pretty lucky that we have a university such as this. So what I really like to take people to take away is the notion of privilege that we're all very, we should be grateful to be alive. That if you think back 200 years, the possibility of I'm 68, the possibility of somebody like me having lived to 68 was pretty small. So essentially we're living longer lives, we're living better lives, and overall I think that's what I think we should take back from all of us, that how privileged we all are. And not to whine, not to complain, because it could I'm a terrible optimist. I always believe it could be worse.